What is up, my guys? I do welcome to my channel. It's your boy, and I'm back again. So, guys, hopefully, you've had a nice weekend and you're ready for the new week as well. Before I continue, guys, let me just prompt you if you haven't, guys, make sure you subscribe. Also, make sure you go watch my Rolls Royce episode two that is out now. I'll leave the link for that down below as well. So, we've got the Yeezy Quantum High Res Cora. We'll talk about this shoe briefly. Quick video, nothing much to say. So, uh, Bam, as you guys can see, big ups to Source Supply every single time. Make sure you guys go check them out for all the information on upcoming releases and drops. So as you guys can see that you've got the Yeezy Quantum, which when it came out, had the nice two or three tone colorway. It came in black, a bit of white and gray. However, now they're getting a little bit adventurous. They're doing a lot of weird colors together. And with this one, it comes with quite a few different colors. So you've got the main part of the shoe, which is the front, which has got that blue it's kind of like that like um what's that called like that sea moss color and it's also apparent on the back of the shoe towards the ankle part and then in this on the side just in the you know from the front to the back of the shoe you've got those like citrusy yellowish lines which start from the front next to the toe box and then run to the sea moss part on the back as well and then, interestingly enough, you've got that Transylane Volcano, orange, shoes on fire, I guess, effect, which is on the side, on the bottom. What do you guys think? I think there's a clash of colors, and I've got a problem with this color scheme. I don't think it goes well together for um, quite a few reasons. The first being, you've got like a subtle color, like CMOS is a very subtle color. Then you've got the opposite of that, which is the orange. And then you've got the yellow as well, which are more like spring colors. And now we're heading towards, you know, winter time. It's autumn time and trees are going to be yellow and orange. So it's just like, I just don't think it's it's doing any justice because when you think of an outfit to style with this as well, you've got to, you know, um, consider the colors as well. So how are you going to incorporate the colors of the shoe into the outfit as well is a very important question. You buy shoes based on the outfit you're gonna wear as well as vice versa as well. So they both need to complement each other. And I do struggle. I mean, you might do maybe say wear uh, some denim jeans that are like, they're kind of uh, not a blue, 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 but they're like kind of a bluish green. So I don't know what that uh, palette is like, you know, that like, mixture of blue and green together when it comes to denim and it's faded and then you might want to incorporate maybe say like a, a light brown a very light brown top or it could be a shirt it could be a hoodie you know then you put them on as well it's just and also the price of paying 220 pounds that is premium there's better shoes you can just buy for that price or even less so yeah it's just you know, just one of them shoes. Yeah, pretty much. What do you guys think? Comment down below. Will you buy this? These obviously won't make any money, so please don't go and buy this shoe. Guys, as I said, it's going to be a quick one. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys soon. Enjoy your Sunday. Bye.